first marker of a milk bottle. Got the uh, name, address, suburb, postcode, all that on there. Uh, just give it a first measure. Third pot of the afternoon. He's got a few in here. Let's get him a measure. Behind the eyes, the end of the carapace is over. Oh, and he's got a hold of that. He wants to measure himself. And then we check this little boy over here. Jesus. This boy looks like he might be under. Oh no, he's legal. See, he's been the eye socket, one's passed. Beautiful. That's two from two. We've got a couple in here. We're putting the rest in here. How's that? How's that big boy? See if it's a boy, which it is. Yes, it's a boy. Look at that. How nice is that? Oh man, look at that. That's a nice big boy. Jesus. Do you want to grab him? Strong buggers, you don't want to get your finger in there. What about that one? <laughs> Alright, come on. Look at that guy. Look at this little measure all of them DPI or every tackle store should have them Murray Cray, Spiny Freshwater Cray the minimum says on there 10 centimeters and the maximum of 12 centimeters for males females strictly go back females usually have eggs or they don't have these two spots right here these two right here they're, they're his little boy bits just measure in there. As you can see from the top of the carapace, the start of his tail, the start of his eyes, he's he's well short of the mark. He he gets a second chance at life. We are fishing with the captain, cooking with the captain, I put my chef hat on. Murray Craze. <laughs> we got to Murray Craze on the weekend. Uh, we kept a few to do a cook up. I had to show you guys how it can be done. Don't know how good it would be, but we'll give it a crack. We'll show you how. We cook it, usually you get done over a uh, campfire with a few tinnies, but we've got the luxury of the Shangri-La Barbie and stove. Beautiful craze into the boiling water. First thing is to add a bit of heap of salt into the boiling water. A bit more. Spray. Beautiful spray into boiling water. You go one, two, three, big boy, four. And now with that, we're gonna start our timer. We're gonna wait for three minutes and we'll pull out the first two. All right, he's been in for just over three minutes. Gonna pull them out. Here we 
and look at these bad boys. Just gonna run them under some cold water. Stop cooking process. So we're gonna move a bit of a cool down some cold water. Um, when you're camping, something's got ice in your ice box, leave them in the ice box for a couple of minutes. Now we've got the full tray there. What I'm gonna do down the middle, if she doesn't move, bam, in there like that. Bam, look at that. Down the gut, literally, down the middle. Oh, yeah. So now we've got two halves. We'll do that to both of them. Now we've got all the uh, segments ready to go. Before we go on the barbie, what we're gonna do is we're gonna crack the big claw, just get the back of your knife. Give it a good whack. Open her up, get it cracked but not completely open. So that's all the big cord size. Boom. Boom. I'm about to cook these, they're still opaque in the middle. So I'm gonna do the barbie's nice and hot. It's just sitting on high. What I'm going to do is I'm going to lay them down there, not so as much as grill them, but more the fact of pretty much baking them uh, with the heat running through. I'm going to go shelf side down, so it doesn't burn or dry out. Oh, what I'm going to do is just got some garlic, uh, just got some butter, just melt it in the, um, in the microwave. Finally chopped uh, some garlic, salt. Pretty simple, pretty basic. I'm just gonna lay that on. On there, give it about another couple minutes until all that butter's melted and gone through. We'll just turn it down a little bit. Shut the lid. These bad boys, they're ready. They're ready to come out. Sorry. These guys are done. 